Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your time and where you're watching from. Thank you for stopping by. It's your lovely girl, Lola's Kitchen and Family. Today's recipe, I'll be showing you how I made this delicious soup, staring at you. The Opo soup, the grandma's recipe. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh no, I know you want to know and you cannot wait to see that. So let's go. I'm going to teach you how to make it and you're going to love it right away. Oh. <laughs> So guys, the first thing we'll do is to boil our shaki. So it's washed and in a pot. So we'll go ahead and add some salt. And a seasoning cube. Then we'll let it cook for 10 minutes before adding the other meat. Moshaki is harder than uh, meat beef I mean so we we'll boil it for 10 minutes before we add the beef So guys, the shaki has been cooking for 10 minutes now, so it's time to bring in uh, beef and I will cook the shaki and the beef for 20 minutes before we proceed to another step. While this is cooking, I'll go ahead and blend ogiro berry, crayfish and fresh pepper together in a blender. I will do that off camera to save time. So guys, the beef and the shaki has been cooking for 20 minutes. Was the 10 minutes the shaki cooked so it's all together 30 minutes so now I'll be adding the dry fish this is barracuda fish that I bought washed and dry it myself I dried the barracuda fish myself so and the tilapia as well so I'm adding them in now and uh, smoke turkey I love smoke turkey very much that I use it in almost all my dishes I love it so much then I will add oil not much oil depends what you want the quantity of oil that you want I'm okay with this then I'll now add some water and bring all of them to a boil. So this is this. This is grandma's recipe. The opo soup. <laughs> this opo soup is something that my husband doesn't joke with, you know. Anytime I make opo soup, he's always happy to the moon and back. <laughs> So we'll bring this to a boil and while it's cooking, I will go ahead and cut the Uziza leaf. So guys, while the, all the animalistic in the pot are cooking, uh, it's time to cut our Uziza leaf. This is the blended um, fresh pepper crayfish and um, ogiro bay in the blender I blended it and the chairman of the occasion is this the opo this is opo 
cocoa powder just like you have a uh, archie and offer but this one is the obenge of the obenges you understand <laughs> if you know you know this is grandma secret soup thickener oh you can't go wrong with this it's sweeter it's better than um archie and offer although it could it could differ as in from person to person but for me this is the best the best for me the best for my husband you know so this is the obenge of the soup so let's go ahead and cut the oziza this oziza is looking like this because it just made its way out from the freezer okay you know how it's here anything anytime we get to get these leaves oziza ugo nchangu which is scent leaf we buy and clean them and put them in the freezer yeah because we don't see it every day so guys this has been cooking for some minutes so it's time to add in our blended pepper crayfish and obey into the soup I'm gonna rinse this and get it back in the pot. I have a lot. Yeah. So we'll give it a stir. Let it boil for two minutes. Then we'll come back and add the opo powder. Wow. Only the flavor alone is so wonderful irresistible so we'll come back in two minutes so far I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to look after myself have you tried conflicts with granite it's so heavenly try this combo together and tell me what it feels like this is me i always look after myself whenever i'm cooking okay i can't come and kill myself enjoy mm. so guys it's time to add in the opo powder the bambacious bambacity the obenge of the soup mm-hmm mm. I said so. It's time for the obenge of the soup to come in. So I'm gonna go with eating spoon one, two, and three. Okay, and I will give it a stir. And the next thing is to add the ozeza leaf and we are done. Once the opo powder is cooked and dissolved properly, we we'll add the ozeza leaf and our opo soup is done and ready. So guys, it's time for the last family to come in as you can see it has taken up and is ready so we'll just go ahead and add the ususa leaf and the opo soup is ready have you watched up to this time and you're still there <laughs> looking at that subscription button please just press it press it go ahead support your baby girl okay support me to do more i appreciate if this is your first time stopping by thank you so much god bless you for my returning subscribers god bless you thank you 
all of you are amazing i am always here because of you guys i can't do this if you're not supporting me thank you god bless you and may you never lack may all your heart desires be accomplished god bless you subscribe leave a comment leave a like and I will see you in my next video. Let's go and serve this food, okay? So guys, our Ubo soup is ready. It can go with any swallow, okay? This soup is grandma's recipe. You can never go wrong with it. So this is the Ubo soup that we made. Thank you for watching, thank you for stopping by, thank you for subscribing, for liking and for commenting. God bless you.